without teaching a specific brush pattern, I want to show you something that you can practice and eventually uh, you can come up with any kind of brush pattern if you get comfortable moving the brush on the head. So I have my students play from the top of the drum head to the bottom. In other words, away and then towards you. And connecting the strokes so that there's no interruption. And one, and two, and three. And you can do this at different tempos. And then we change it to a tap. We try to make the taps equal. Okay? Can you do that for a while and then we change direction? We'll go side to side. And then we start to learn how much of the hand or wrist or arm to use. And a lot of times we don't want to use too much wrist because we want to keep the brush relationship of the head similar. So I'm moving more from the elbow or shoulder. And we add a tap. I can do it in uh, X or diagonal. Something a little faster. One and two and tap. And then we can start doing a diagonal away, which uses a different part of the brush. Different speed. Tap. 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 And you can do half circles and these kind of things. So it's a nice meditation and eventually then you can start to combine these. And if the Guerrero player doesn't show up, you can play Oye Como Va, no problem. <laughs> Oye Como Va. Okay. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. Au revoir. <laughs>